Some normal people like to keep dogs and cats as pets, and in some rare cases, they might go wild and own a hamster. But some people own some of the most dangerous and scary looking animals. From hissing cockroaches to hyenas, let's look at the 10 scariest pets people actually own. Number 10, Tailless Whip Scorpion. This creature looks like it just came from the set of Alien vs. Predator. If you think it looks like a mix of a spider, a crab, and scorpion, you're probably wrong. This is a very famous scorpion that's kept as a pet by many people around the globe. This creature has eight long, thin legs, two pincers, and eight eyes across them, which just makes the tailless whip scorpion a weird and scary pet to have. They can grow up to 2 to 30 inches long, depending on the species. Whip scorpions are safe enough to let walk all over your face, but we don't know why anyone would do that. Whip scorpions are arachnids that have a similar appearance to true scorpions, but don't possess a venomous sting. While they're not venomous, they can spray an acidic mix that has a vinegar-like smell which is not really harmful to the pet owner, but it is good to take precautions, like crushing this monstrosity with your Jordans. Number 9. Vietnamese Centipedes Vietnamese centipedes have an unknown origin, but can be found in almost every tropical region including Vietnam, Southeast Asia, Central America, and South America. It's important to replicate the environment in which they're found, Humidity and temperature are the most important factors for general health and comfortability. Proper care of your centipede will provide mutual safety and may potentially extend the life of your specimen. Vietnamese centipedes are sensitive to stress and will attack anything they consider a threat. They're actually a very common pet to own in Asia, especially for teenagers who are just a tad bit strange. This species of centipede is so large that it actually looks like something out of an alien movie. They can grow to around 8 inches long and actually have two modified legs on their heads with which they hunt. Even though death from a bite of a Vietnamese centipede is almost unheard of, the venom is said to cause extreme pain. Therefore, you want to exercise caution and care with this centipede, but our first advice would be, how about you just don't own it? Number 8. Tigers. You might be shocked to hear this, but the majority of tigers live as pets and not in wildlife. According to a study done by the BBC, about 5,000 tigers live in legal captivity in more than a dozen states. They're kept as privately owned pets, while the population of wild tigers has decreased to about 3,890, according to the World Wildlife Fund. Owning a pet tiger might sound thrilling. But if you want to know what it's like having a tiger as a pet, you should definitely try to talk to Mike Tyson. That is, if you can get an appointment. But caring for it can be a serious challenge. A tiger's diet can consist up to 88 pounds of meat in one sitting, and its enclosure should be as big as 40 square miles. While studies show tigers can peacefully coexist with people, the frustrated, cooped-up cat has the capacity to eventually lash out and kill a few members of the family. So before owning a tiger, try to ask yourself, why would you even want to own a tiger? Number 7. Hissing Cockroach Not many insects are as universally loathed as cockroaches, and most people probably haven't thought about bringing one into their homes on purpose. But cockroaches can be the ultimate low-maintenance pet. They're sturdy and slow enough to be handled quite easily. There's a specific type of cockroach that actually hisses, and it's so large that it might just give you anxiety. This creature can grow to about 3 inches long, and the more aggressive they get with time, the more they hiss. They use this hissing for breeding, too. They use it to attract potential mates. Cockroaches might just look ugly, but they're not really harmful to humans. Hissing cockroaches don't even have any wings, so you don't have to worry about losing them. Number 6. Pac-Man Frog Native to South America, Pac-Man frogs are amphibians that are relatively common in the pet trade. As strictly terrestrial amphibians, they're very poor swimmers. Instead, they spend most of their time in a humid environment among damp leaf litter. 
These scary and mean-looking frogs get their common name from the popular Pac-Man arcade game, because, like the animated character, these frogs have a rounded appearance with huge mouths. Pac-Man frogs are not difficult to care for, and they make for some interesting pets. Pac-Man frogs feed on crickets, worms, and mice. Uh, yeah, that's right, you heard that correctly. A full-grown Pac-Man frog can eat mice. They can grow up to a huge size and can be very aggressive. They might also eat each other, so it's a good idea not to keep two together. Number 5. Capybara If you're fine with owning a huge, scary-looking rodent as a pet, then the capybara is a good choice. While the capybara is a rodent, it's nothing like a guinea pig or hamster. They're one of the largest rodents in the entire world. These rodents are semi-aquatic animals, so if you're looking to adopt a capybara, they'll definitely need access to water in order to swim around. The capybara grows up to 4 feet long and weighs more than 100 pounds. Although mostly adorable and sweet, capybaras can be a challenging pet. They do better in groups as they're extremely social animals, so pet owners should avoid getting just a single capybara. In short, they're high-maintenance animals, so they need a lot of care and a lot of space. In some states, it's legal to own one, but they require licenses. If you don't know whether it's legal in your state, check with your local registration before deciding to bring home a capybara as a pet. Or if you love rodents so much, you can always move to Texas or Pennsylvania, because it's legal to own a capybara there, obviously. Number 4. Skunks of all the scariest pets to own on this list, skunks might be one of the most notorious. You might think that they're disgusting and don't deserve to be inside the home. In many states throughout the US, skunks are actually totally legal to own. Most commonly, states will require you to descent the skunk before you have it as a pet. Owning a skunk means that you may have a bit of a problem with keeping it indoors. They tend to dig into things and claw at wood floors but they can be trained. Due to bad eyesight, if the skunk wanders away, it also won't come back home. A skunk makes an excellent pet, of course if you have their scent glands removed. However, you should be dedicated to the skunk, because they can't be released into the wild when their scent glands are removed. A pet skunk is easy to take care of after they're trained, and this adorable animal requires little care. Number 3. Serval even though Serval is not an ideal pet for everyone, it is an incredibly beautiful exotic cat that comes from Africa that people actually own. It's not the same as a simple cat. Servals aren't typically aggressive, but they can be difficult to own, as they're still considered wild. These beautiful animals can be very affectionate, but they have survival instincts that you may not be able to train. It is legal to own a Serval in almost half of the states of America, in some states like North Carolina, West Virginia. In some states like North Carolina and West Virginia, you can own one without a license required. You can obtain a license to own a serval in states like Montana, Texas, Arizona, Mississippi, and quite a few others. However, it's illegal to own one of these big cats in many other states, so if you're looking forward to owning one, don't forget to check if your city and state laws allow it. And with all of that, it's now time for today's subscriber pick. Today's photo was sent to us by one of our subscribers, so if you come across a photo online and want to know more details about it, just send it on over to us. We might even feature it on a future video. Number 2. Hyena Don't be misled by the cringing creature seen in The Lion King. From their biology to their social structure, spotted hyenas are complex creatures like none other on Earth. They're considered nature's thugs, condemned as dim-witted cowards, skulking in back alleys, waiting for an opportunity to mug others. But they're not like that at all. All hyenas belong to one of four species that includes the spotted hyena, the brown hyena, the striped hyena, and the aardwolf. The spotted hyena tends to be a highly social species, while other hyena species tend to be a little less social. There's evidence that people and hyenas can form a strong bond. People in Africa keep them as pets to show their strength. 
owning a hyena as a captive animal is allowed in certain states within the United States. Nevada has some of the loosest pet restrictions. Number 1. Hippo The hippopotamus is probably the most dangerous pet to have anywhere in the world. There have been multiple cases of hippos killing their owners. They can weigh up to 3,300 pounds and can run up to 19 miles per hour. They're equally fast in water, so if you're being chased by a hippo, you have nowhere to run. The hippo is a large, mostly herbivorous, semi-aquatic animal and ungulate native to sub-Saharan Africa. Hippos have to grow up fighting with the likes of crocodiles and lions for survival. Keeping them as a pet is not an easy job, and they can get very aggressive when annoyed. People do own hippos, but there have been cases of hippos going wild and even killing their owners. So keep them at your own risk. And that's been our list of 10 scariest pets people actually own. Which one of these would you like to keep as a pet? Let us know in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel. Thanks for watching.